This is Matt with Van Dam Construction. I made a barn door. These aren't terribly difficult to make. You can make them with just a few basic tools. A skill saw, a little brad nailer gun. If you don't have that, you could even do it without it and you can just clamp wood together. It might take a little longer. But I'm going to go through the steps of what I did to make this barn door. This one's antiqued, so we had to paint it one color, sand it down, paint it another color, sand it again, and make it look like it's been weathered. Here you go. This barn door is just made out of fence planks. I lay them out like this. Make sure these are lined up together. And then you overlap it, but you stagger it about half the width of one of these boards. And that way you can overlap, and then later you put a trim piece right down there to cover the joint and to strengthen it up a little bit. Wood glue everything, and then just use one inch finish nails. Brad Nellers. Here's how it looks without all the trim on it. Later you see there will be a trim piece right down in the middle. There will be an X across the bottom part. And then just a trim piece around all the perimeter of it. Here's the door with the first coat of primer on it. Starting to come together. This is the kind of primer I used. I made the mistake, usually I get water soluble, but this one happens to be an oil based, which is fine, but you have to clean it up with mineral spirits, you can't just rinse it out with water. Next thing to do after you primed everything is get some brown spray paint, spray over all the corners, and then later we'll cover this with white and then sand it, and then it'll reveal some of this brown and it'll give it a nice antique look. I use a satin. You don't want it too glossy. It doesn't look like it's made for wood. It'll look weird. So satin brown, spray paint all over it. We went with a 40 grit, just really light. Now we're following it up with 150. And if that's not smooth enough, we got another 220 that we might go over. But the 40 was just abrasive enough to take off a bunch of the white and give us the general effect, but it did leave it scratchy. So this is just smoothing out all the scratch marks. There's a completed product. You don't want to be on YouTube? <laughs> Van Dam Construction is a commercial contractor. We build custom homes, we build a lot of stuff. We like to focus more on custom woodworking, but we'll build anything. If you can dream it up, we'll build it. We make videos of some of our more notable projects, some of the more interesting ones, some of the ones we think people would like. We try to post these videos on YouTube as often as we can. Check it out. Subscribe if you want the updates. We're always trying to do something unique, something that will stand out. Check us out.